Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Injection, fellas. Don't call it a comeback. I've been here for years. Don't call it a comeback. I've been here for years. Let me see you go back. What's up music fans, it's your girl Les, and I know you love your golden era hip hop and R&B kings and queens just as much as I do. See all you social media fans have been hitting me up going, Les, where's Chubb Rock? Where's Horace Brown? What happened to the group Lede or Jade? Well, if you want to know, then you need to rock with me. Because even though you haven't seen them, they've mastered the behind the scenes game and they've got staying power. And you know how I do, right? VIP style, backstage access, Call them on the phone, get them on Skype. You know how we roll. So if you want to know what's going on with your favorite artists, then you need to rock with me. Because don't call it a comeback. They've been here for years. And this is Moments in Music with Les. I think people are quietly sleeping on the fact that even for decades now, yeah. you have been producing Mary J. Blige, Christina Aguilera, Pussycat Dolls, yeah. and now, Vivian Green. Yeah, yeah, that 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 project is very special to me because that's on my label mm -hmm. through Capitol Records, and so it's like, for the first time in my career, I'm able to control right. the product that comes out. One, I produced my first album. I produced, you know, records for people around me. I've been doing this for a very long time. I think at a point, you sit and realize, you say, okay, I got plaques on the wall. I got number one records, I sold this amount of albums, I sold that amount of albums, but yet, I'm still auditioning. Yeah, 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 yeah. You Stick even the remember the first day that you heard your song on the radio? I do, I was at home in East New York, mm -hmm. and a car drove by, and I heard it, and I went to the window to see if it was somebody who I had probably gave a cassette tape that was parking in front of my house. The car just kept going, I didn't know the person. Then another car came by and I heard it again. It was like, the sun's on the radio. Did you guys know that Kenny was ill? I did uh, the whole last year. Yeah. Like, during uh, the, his whole time, he didn't share with me, but when we came back to do album number three, um, actually on the first session when we got back in the studio, he told me. An exclusive just for you. When all is said and done, and we turn the lights down low, I can close my eyes. Find the place I know We go back like the two Asian chicks on Way Soul back. Train Way with back. the long hair <laughs> when Jody Wiley was on my man Raphael Sadiq in house That's what's, up. what's up Ray Ray? Hey, you know just keeping it grimy. Can I just say, you know, you really are one of the true people who've been keeping it funky, like for real, all these years. And I think the worst question I think any viewer can ever ask is where have you been, or what have you been up to? Well, it's, it's been um, it's been up and you know ups and downs, but um, it's been great actually. It's uh, you know it's it's something I always like to do is like rediscover myself and mm -hmm. have people rediscover me. And, and I think in the beginning of my career, people didn't really know what I was doing or didn't really understand what I was doing. But basically, this whole time I've been really trying to. I was making music for myself. It's about that self, that feeling that I get when I, you know, when I'm driving mm -hmm. down, you know, Slauson, coming from the airport, like from New York, two or three in the morning, and I hear like anniversary. I hear that long part, mm. an anniversary, and I'm just sitting in the car, like it's like I don't really even believe that that's me.